Uh, looking up to the sky, would you be able to differentiate types of clouds or features? We're all familiar with rainbows and how they look, but sometimes we'll see different features that will give off rainbow like colors. And this week's science says THP 11 meteorologist Corrales Ortiz will be breaking down the types of optical phenomenon you might see in the sky. This is cloud iridescence. These type of clouds form from tiny ice crystals or water droplets, which can cause light to be bent. These features look like random cloud patches or bands, and when the light spreads, it causes an oil slick type of effect. You can best see them when the feature is positioned near the sun, with the sun hiding behind an object in the foreground, like a building or a tree. Iridescent clouds sometimes get confused with circumhorizon arcs. These type of arcs are features parallel to the horizon and are best visible in wispy cirrus clouds. One way to differentiate them is by their shape and position. Their colors are more organized in order like a rainbow and occur when the sun is high in the sky, about 58 degrees above the horizon. There's a feature similar to this called the circumzenithal arc, which looks like an upside down rainbow. This arc is centered on the zenith or the highest point in the sky and found at least 46 degrees above the sun when it sits low in the sky. Ever heard of sun dots? Well, according to the National Weather Service, these features look like a pair of colored patches within a halo when the sun is lower in the horizon. They are located roughly 22 degrees to the left and or right of the sun. Sun dogs are sometimes called mock suns and happen during very cold temperatures. Some of these features are more rare than others due to latitude and can be difficult to tell apart even for some experts, but they are nice to look at. With THB 11, I'm Corrales Ortiz. Well, if you have any other type of weather related misconceptions, folklore, or just questions you want Corrales to explain, Send her an email, cortiz at thp11.com or reach out to her on social media. We're back with more Wake Up Central right after this.